So today we're installing an ETC card reader in my Sylvia. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's this little bad boy here. Uh, it's just a little card reader for the toll system in Japan. Now, here it is here, the ETC card reader, um, and this one comes with the little external speaker as well, so I can mount that anywhere you want. Got plenty of wire length as well, so you can trace that pretty much anywhere in the car if we really wanted to. Um, this one here comes with, you can see there, five wires. Now, most of them, and what I've seen, most of them come with just three. Uh, it's just uh, your, your positive normally, and then your ground, and then just a yellow, which is just ignition. Um, you can just pretty much put the yellow and the red to ignition and then black to ground and that should work perfectly. This one was a bit different and a little bit more tricky. I couldn't really find much information online about it, but to get it working, I've played around with it just before, uh, just off camera to make sure it is all working and everything. Um, I've got the black and then there's a black and gray wire, put them together for ground and then the green and red. Tested that, it seemed to work. So, so this is pretty much all good to go. Um, you can see I've Done the wires there, um, and we can probably we'll head over the car. Actually, I'll show it working. Just put this to the battery terminals, just show you how it's meant to work. Um, and then we'll get on to putting it in the car. So we've got here the ETC card reader. We'll chuck the speaker just like so. Get the green and the red, put it to positive. Shove that one down in there. And then the negative, we'll just chuck on there should start up. Awesome. So that's all ready to go into the car and wire up. So you can see here, I've torn down the pillar gauge um, there just to get to the wiring because in my instance, probably the easiest way to just wire the, um, the ETC card reader is just piggybacking off these because I've already done the work. Um, so we know it's easy enough, it's just there. Um, you can go to really anything uh, as long as it's an ignition source and a ground. So you can go into the center console um, is usually where most people do it. Um, currently mine, my center console doesn't have any power, so that's the reason why I'm not doing it there. But yeah, this one is probably the next easiest and easiest to, I, I guess, get to. So we'll uh, remove some of these connections and just pretty much piggyback the ETC card reader into those ones. And yeah, it's pretty much it really. So I've finished the wiring part of it. It's not the prettiest thing, but it's gonna work. So that's all that matters. Um, so now we just have to trace the wires and kind of position the ETC card reader where we want it as well as the microphone uh, or the speaker. Um, and then, yeah, that's really, really it. So the card reader is in the car. Um, honestly, a easy, easy install. Um, the hardest part I'd say is probably just figuring out where to wire the actual thing, like tracing the wires and stuff like that, and putting the ETC card reader, deciding where that goes. Um, it was quite easy in my instance uh, for the Sylvia, but um, yeah, so now we've got that awesome Japanese lady saying insert your ETC card reader. I think it's cool. Let me know if you think it's cool in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video.